know, man. Roy Nietzsche looking pretty strong. Yeah, He's everyone, everyone here, give it up for Peru, y'all. Yeah, give it up. Peru grand final. Make some noise here for Peru. Let's get a big old guy. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what that means. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I feel like we are getting so much trouble. Just use the Japanese option selects. Sumimasen everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> That's, it's so hard to get that out of my brain, too. Sumimasen for everything. <laughs> Every time in a foreign country, I bump into some Sumimasen. Oh, wait, I'm not even in Japan. <laughs> wait a minute. Yeah. All right, here we go. The first game of Grand Finals. It's going to be Roy Nietzsche versus Abel De Maestro. Abel De Maestro coming in from winner's side, though. OK, there it is. He went with the Huarong the first time, but this time he's going with Geese. Yeah, I mean, he did have a good set there against Nene the Dragon. Yeah, his game plan definitely worked out. The down fours for the high crush and the couple counter edge here and there and the back three twos to cut him off from his wave dash mix up. Come on. How was this match for Geese? This, this match got be worse nice. because the back three nerf, actually. So he can't get a full combo conversion by picking up with back three, which was his answer to pick up relax. Ah. So this kind of hurts, but you can still get a combo if you decide to burn it here, but that's an expensive combo. Oh, yeah, right away. So be, there might be a lot of fireballs coming up El Demaestro's way because of the lack of a good sidestep from Eddie. But I've seen Abel Demaestro earlier on in this tournament really utilizing the bogey step, the old school strategy of the back hit sidestep. Oh, yeah. Just utilizing that to get a rip around uh, Geese's uh, fireball. One too many hits in that combo there. The board one didn't connect. Jumps away from the mix-up. Really smart. I like that. That's definitely something that one of his friends told him. Jump from the mix-up. Yeah. But he didn't tell him to not get counter hit by down four two. Wow. wow. It picked him up from relax. He definitely hit a button. Interesting. Broke the wall. So now we're in a very big wall stage here. Probably not the best situation for Roy broke all the walls on the first round. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, this actually, I mean, Geese can still carry like crazy. Yeah, he can. But this, but this is uh, definitely a good situation for any players, just because, you know, you have more room to maneuver. All right, get a quick uh, back roll catch. Oh, yeah, there's the back three again. So you, what, what does he get then? Just like down four? He gets the back three, back three, back three. <laughs> yeah, as that's, a float combo. That's a combo? Yeah. Like I say, he tried it, but he knows. Apple, of course, knows. He used the power crush from handstand to blow through it. Can't do it there. No dunk on the second hit. Yeah, maybe thought he was going to max go cancel out of it. Oh, doesn't finish the string. Didn't get the gears oh, range. So close. Wow, he risked it all there. A oh, what? Big low. What's it going to be? Time is a factor. No. What? And the counter hit. And he saved the meter, even though he max mode canceled. He canceled it right after he died. That's the thing, man, with these or these meter characters. You, you, the previous hit right before the one that blows the meter, you save the meter. Yeah. Right, so Roy Nietzsche looking good here. To start off this game one. It has been solid. Oh, the mid parry gets baited. Nice. It's an easy punish there. Nice oh, micro carry. dash back to four Ooh. for the wall carry. That was sexy. Yes, pop up on him. <laughs> I approve of that supercharge. <laughs> that was a great wall combo. Wall carry everything. Yeah, little thing, man. Yeah. We're going each with three bars. The rare, oh, the, the rare geese. Oh, dude, he's so good at hit confirming that. He can burn it. Yes, he can, and this might be death. Yes. Stand up, die. Beautiful. Look at that 80% combo, and that's a three meter combo. And that's the benefits of playing geese with three meters on a potential set point. Yeah. If you have any, any opportunity to get a wall combo, you can burn it. Yeah, he's that's an 80% lead if yeah. you get the wall. That's it. It's. it's too much. Yeah, yeah Roy you know, he, like, he's, he's playing that that weird, like, super supercharged up geese where it's like, all right, I'm not going to use my meter that much. Right. I'm he's not using it really well. Yeah, it's like, all right, you know what? Hold, hold on, hold on. All right, here, now I have three bars. Now you're really scared. Yeah, now you're done. <laughs> if I hit you, you're dead. <laughs> it's like going straight to the infinite stage. Good choice from Avil. Doesn't want that extra bonus wall damage on his end. Oh, yeah, for sure. So now the, now your three meters only becomes useful for that uh, reset. Yeah, the reset which is combo. still good, too. <laughs> yeah, it's still hella good. Nice pick up. He got there in time. Yep, yeah. yeah, can't get the Jake in there. <laughs> oh, I like that. 
Nice jump. Dude, the way he's getting in through these fireballs, that was sick. Just a forward three to check him. Cool. Castle into the air fireball. Abel wasn't ready for that. Yeah, you don't see that very often. Yeah, not now. the normal version. Yeah. Yeah. You only see it in max mode. Out the air, mini blow combo. Could have had a little more if he did force with forward three, but it's all good. Small lead for there it is, the bogey step to avoid yeah. the fireball, even with Eddie. Definitely, it's not, it's not too difficult, but it's one of those things where it's like you gotta practice it a little bit. Mm -hmm. It's a very weird command. It's like a like a Marvel command where you do mag you know that magneto thing, yeah. opposite quarter circle forward. You're doing from forward to down basically. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. So patient here. Building walls right now. Great wall of Peru. Oh, wow. Wow. The fireball was still in his head. I saw that. You see that? He turned into Claudio for a second. Yeah. He's like, I have to start. Oh. Set. He's like, damn, I had, I had a runny two for a second. <laughs> That was sweet. I can't believe I have actually never seen that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he tried doing the back one plus two to avoid the uh, mix up there, but we're each kind of doing it. Oh, didn't get a launch either. Actually, kind of hard, right? Because while sending one's a high. Caught him with the mid now. Oh, just for the chip? Why? I don't even think don't that's enough. He's trying to get the chip damage. Oh. He caught him airborne at the last second. All he he thought he was going to do a grounded fireball, so he tried to jump over it because of the chin. Yeah, all he had to do was just back up, but he got too antsy there. Got him with the counting and down flap, too. Oh, he thought he was in range for the Jake and just barely. Oh, good conversion. Nice. Oh, just a little early on the down forward four. He'll still tap here and got the, and got the uh, crush on the down jab. Putting wow. up a much better fight with the geese pick. I'm liking this. Try to catch the, the trip card on the way down. Oh, wow. Just close enough to get this. Oh, try to squeeze a little more damage out of him. Didn't quite get, like get it. Oh, get out of the air. I don't care what you're trying to do up there. Oh, fireballs again. Back to the neutral. Oh, oh nice. nice block. Man, read that. Yeah, he saw that Roy Nietzsche was going for that a little too much at the end of the round. Read it. Jump in combo, nice. Yeah, Ronichi definitely utilizing the fireballs way more. Right, here we go. Nice block. Oh man, there's the down four. He's really good with that move. A lot of times just landing counter hits on it. Mixing it up really well with dashing up back three, but gets a counter of his own. Yeah, so strong. The meters, though, this is going to be good for Ryuji. He wins this round and is able to hold on to it, but he might not have an opportunity. He chased him down, used the frame disadvantage to his favor, stuck a safe counter hit and fishing move. Got it. Frame storm, get off me, not going to be. Wow! Waited out the active frame, scooped his ass up. Yeah, that's, a, that's one of the biggest baits, right? Raging Storm has a huge, huge time of uh, hit, active hit frames. Right. You can't just run into it willy-nilly after, after he says Storm because it's still after. Yeah, you got to wait for it all to dissipate and then go in there. He knew it. Stood at the right range. He's like, okay, I'm chilling, bro. Yeah, and whip punish perfectly, too. That was gorgeous. Got Roinichi to spend the meter and just like, you know what? All right. That was cool. So far, the geese pick has been working out a lot better than the, the Huarong. Yeah, but it's still 1-1. One, one. Abel's just too strong. In Dumo de City. I feel like this is the first time we fought here. I can definitely see it in this stage. Uh, somebody picked this stage earlier. But <laughs> <laughs> Who picks this stage? <laughs> Claudio Mains. Claudio Mains, huh? right? I know. <laughs> Blue hand wearing. <laughs> Gosh. Vamos lá. I guess Geese wants one. to be a Claudio main. He tried to for a second. Yeah. Team Lusa. Oh, nice. Big carry. The wall, just short of it. Wow. Stuffed out of the running one. Pick up off the side, though. Oh, yeah. The side wall spike messed that combo up. Again. Decent punish. Good yeah. Stuff. And Roynichi, I can tell whenever he's doing that board one on accident, he doesn't save himself by doing a. Uh, any uh, cancel or Yeah, any cancel. Yeah, so, ooh, getting the down four this time. Last time he used the power crush to go through it. 
Good recognition from Roichi there. Nice, nice conversion. Oh no, that's... Not, he meant to do down 2-3. He got a down back 2-3. Oh, damn. Did he suck? Oh my! Oh, and Tech Trap! Yeah, Tech Trap He knew. Too. He just waited it out. Wow. Beautiful there from Abel. And man, look at this. It's, a, it's becoming like the winner's final again. There's that back to two to cut off the opponent's offense again. And Ronichi now using his meter for good. All right, got that little extra damage with the four one. Oh, the down jab on his Oki. Mm -hmm. The re-splat combo style launching a maximum meter build for the next round. Very optimal combo for that situation. Yeah, perfect there for Ronichi doing great work there. Slapping him out of the air. I think he recognized it was a float down for two and not a counter hit. Messing up the Jake and though. Yeah, that, was, that could be costly, but he still has the meter to mess around with. And still has the wall position. Yeah. A little scared of that. Uh, Eddie's relaxed, though, so he's trying to back away. Ooh, there we go. Got the wall again. Nice. Down you. Yeah. That was sick. That down jab to catch him out of the relaxed transition. That was beautiful. Ooh, oh, caught him at the tail end of it. Oh, now Roy Nietzsche, if he can win this round with those two meters, I said this last time. So <laughs> oh, scary. There it is. He's going to have one for the next round. Nice. Man, he look, it looked so bad for him. He's piecing it together. He's making it work. He gets the big float. Dash jab combo. What's the combo? Yeah, nice. going to get this wall, too. Of course, it's Geese. Double, Double. Max damage. One. Another yeah. one. He's so good at that right now. Beautiful combo, so much damage. He could have gone for it again. Five ways to the side. The down jabs are really paying off. Dash block. Dash block. Nice. Look at this. He, you know, that is exactly what Bronson Tran was talking about. Dash block, dash block. He saw that he panicked with up 4-4. Four, four. This time he dashed down 4-1 to yep. get a float. Beautiful adjustment from Roichi. One more game to reset the grand final. Smiling, looking happy, looking stressed. Yeah, <laughs> happy went from, went stress. From, went from happy to stress yeah. real fast. <laughs> <laughs> the eyes rolled all the way back. The face palm. Yeah. But he's keeping it together. He's feeling it. It's right within his grasp. Roy looking good. The geese. Pick has been working out, but Abel going right back to the infinite stage. He doesn't want to deal with the wall carry, the Come extra on. wall damage that Geese can get. Yeah. This might be amusing. And Eddie kind of sucks with walls. <laughs> yeah, he does. He doesn't really get anything Round that one. much better on walls. Fight. And, and it's like the walls end up becoming more of a nuisance than a help. Yeah, it ruins like, his combos more yeah. often. Yeah, it's like, why is this wall here? Oh, damn it. I have to shorten this wall combo now. Everything's messed up. Look at that damage. Huge unskilled hit at the end, too. Being an Eddie main must be rough. Yeah. Just because it's like, what, you're trying to play casuals, but Sometimes it's like, you lose at the stage select. <laughs> yeah. You can't play casuals because then it's like, oh, I'm going to pick a uh, wall of stage. Like, that's not fun. <laughs> I don't want to play you. Uh, almost got to pick up. Wow, the tail end of the Rapukin caught him at the end. Cool. Yeah, he fakes it out with the force go back one, not the two. So it, it looks like Abel de Macho's ready for the two version, trying to look for the follow up, but it's just ending right there and not being punished for it. Oh, big counter down the down fourth, though. Back to the you know, this is also Roy Nietzsche's beat, too. Like, once he does a combo, he's like, all right, I know Eddie kind of has a hard time getting around Fireball, so I'm going to play the little chip game. Yeah, but he doesn't stick to it too long. You know, yeah. it's like one or two fireballs and then right back into this. Able, yeah, there's the float combo. That's all he decides to burn it, make it expensive. Oh, uses nice. it for a big sub. Okay. That was I like how he used that. That was so good. It was like he dropped the combo intentionally just to have the mix up and he got the, the big payoff at the end. Oh, oh yeah, nice. <laughs> Roy Nietzsche, this adjustment, Round this character three. pick really paying off. Fight. Ooh, not quite sure what that was. Yes, low parry for his troubles. That's a fireball game. See, he just jumps over one and he's back in range. Full combo, doesn't get the pick up. Oh. Such a good hit from there for Nietzsche. 
On the mix. Oh, wow. he thought he was going to stay grounded this time. He was expecting him to stay grounded because he used it for the mix last time. That was <laughs> the, the mind games. The lasagna. lasagna. I like this lasagna. My favorite flavor. <laughs> Because we, because we built it ourselves too. We, we were watching. Yeah, we're watching the lasagna get built. We're in the kitchen with them. Yeah, we understand how this lasagna was made. Oh, so a pinch of salt. Oh, damn. That's all it took. That's the ingredients. So simple, but so delicious. Dude, he's doing it upwards. That's the hard way to do it too. Trying to confirm the back three for the counter. No go. Oh, man, he's just dancing on him. Capoeira. Capoeira. All right, Abel looks good here. Oh, using oh. it for mix-up. I like that. Oh. The combo. Wow, right before the fireball became active. Two to two. And I got to say, Roy Nietzsche is going to go for the stage pick here. He wants that wall. Yes. All right, so here we go. Potential tournament point for Abel Del Maestro. Or will Roy Nietzsche reset it for the grand Get final the reset battle, set? Battle, battle. Grand final reset set set. Set, set, set. Sex time. All right, here we go. So much pressure on Abel. Like, even though he's on the winner's side, he's feeling the stress. He doesn't want to go to a rematch. Yeah, I mean, once you get this far, right, and you're just like, all right, I, I can, just if, wanna, I, uh, if I just win this one game, it's over. It's I don't over. have to worry about this guy right? anymore. The stress is all gone, yeah. everything's finally on wine. But if, if he loses this game, then it's like we have to do that all over again. All over again. One more time. What's it going to be? Shima builder now. Abel going with the aggression. Wow, nice low parry too. Nice. Oh, the down jab. No that meter though. Yeah, but that. Oh. The down jab has been Roy Nichi's best offensive tool, especially really for his Oki too to stuff his head. And especially on these stages with the walls, he knows that that's where he's going to get the majority of his damage. He's down jab right here. Oh, right yeah, double jab, down jab there. He's expecting it. Wall standing one counter hit. Oh, so much damage. Maximum meter builds. I love that. So smart. I love that. I know that combo's gonna kill. It's gonna do the most damage. Ooh, what a whiff punish there from Roy Nietzsche, too. And this is just a bad spot for Abel. Every time Abel has had this situation, it's never paid off for him. Yeah, he's never won with the wall. Again! Yes, this Every is time he gets the down one at the wall. Yeah, it, it's pretty much what Beautiful all the combo adjustment to get that second wall splat. And Roy Nietzsche now one round away from sending this to a bracket reset. Had the punish, didn't get the cancel though. Oh, he had the counter hit, he didn't see it. I can't believe. Well, look at that sidestep. Eddie. Well done on the game time. You don't want to risk it. Oh, there we go. Nice. Back one plus two. Oh, what? High pair? Oh, that was a max mode parry. This guy's trying to style. Nice combo, double rep Lucan. Oh. Down jab again for Meaty. No go. Burns it early, first Ooh. time ever. Double Luigi, final, final round! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice back one plus two there. Abel, good. Oh, oh Abel the with the offense. The what? Oh, Big mid parry. Oh, he, he didn't have the meter to extend that combo, so he's going to get this little one, but he, he will have the, the side. meter. Got nice. one now. He has the meter now to use. This is big for both players. Next hit. Oh, ooh, he blocked it in time. No, no, no punish in time. He gets the punish. That could be it. Oh, final chance. Just block it. Down to resets the bracket. R -r 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 reset. And we got to do it all One over again. Time. A fresh new first to three. Now everybody's a loser. This is the time where everybody's a loser. <laughs> <laughs> yep. You remember what we said? 99% of the people yeah, that entered the, the tournament. Yeah, this is 100%. 100%. Everyone's a loser. Got that final 1%. <laughs>
You thought you were safe, huh? Uh -huh. You thought you weren't gonna be a loser. <laughs> nah, you're a loser Everybody's too. Everybody's a loser here today. <laughs> <laughs> but except for us, we can't enter the tournament. That's right. That's right. Yes. <laughs> we're safe. <laughs> safe. <laughs> Baseball slide safe. All right, Roaring Ichi resetting it. The geese pick definitely worked out. Yeah, and it could be all up to this random select here because every time it's been an infinite stage. Yeah, you know what stage each player is going to pick for themselves. No, actually, but the thing is that Roaring Ichi, I think, has been going random. And he's oh. just been getting all on stage. <laughs> he's, a, he's a gambling man. Yes, he <laughs> is. All right, the abandoned temple. Not a terrible stage for either player, I would say, because yeah, there's more the room to biggest to, wall stage in the game. Yeah, more room to to maneuver, but Geese will find that wall no matter what. Yeah, he's he's a dirty cheating bastard. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, game one in this reset bracket here. Round Peru four. versus Peru grand final. Uh huh. Fresh new set. Let's go. <laughs> Roinichi was able to make this reset after getting his back blown out in that winner's final. What a whiff punish there from Abel de Maestro, though. They get the carry combo. Nice. That's always the problem with Eddie. That's all he has. Yeah. Can't really vary up his combo. Ooh, the first time we saw the rodeo. Got Roinichi to another thing to think about. The first time he's thrown out a rodeo. Jabs and cut him off. Caught him dunking. He thought he was going to jab again. To the wall, beautiful flat, to the full combo single, double. Yeah, this one, he always likes to go for the double too, like he yeah. likes the damage. Oh, on Abel's part too, he's been staying down a lot. Yeah. So Roy Nietzsche taking the damage now. He was like, I don't need to be able to just go for damage and stay on the ground. Oh, nice. He's he's like, dude, he knows every angle with these Eddie combos. Oh, nice. The jab and the down one. Roy Nietzsche now tying this set up. Fight. Ooh. All right. He wasn't sure if he could get there in time. Threw out the fireball instead. Nice. Big low parry. This should be the wall. And he has two meters. Will he burn oh, it here? No. no. He it. Not quite the game set point, so maybe that's what he's looking for. I like that, though. Yeah, that's a good strategy. Going into the last round with full stick butter. Wow, just a normal throw again, though. Nornichi hasn't broken a single throw so far. In and out of their ranges. Roy Nishi's like, all right, you're gonna play out of my range? I'm gonna chuck some fireballs then. Come to me. Come to my range. Come to my house. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. He's using some nice things to get around these fireballs. Oh, okay. <laughs> Never seen that on Oh, guess the J-Kin? Reese Black combo, beautiful. Yeah, Time is on Roy Nishi's side. Oh, he's trying to do a ground yeah. throw too. You know, that was actually right. the layer of lasagna again. He's like, you just keep staying down. This time I'm going to ground throw. <laughs> Jesus. He made three lasagnas already. Now the lasagna is not, it's, it's the same lasagna just being built of all the layers. Of yeah. So many, like 12 layers deep already. The never ending lasagna pile keeps on growing. Garfield's going to be so happy about this. <laughs> Big trade in Abel's favor. Final round, first game. This is a crucial game one here for both players. Who's gonna take that first blood? Yeah, because if you're Abel, you won on a walled stage. That's a big thing. You're right. And if you're Roy Nietzsche, you got the you got the advantage. Oh nice. my! The size step three plus four left him off on the axis where the fireball wouldn't oh. hit. Switching uh -oh. sides so too close for that. Yeah, this is the max. He has so much meter. So scary, so scary. Okay, safe option, safe mid option. Uh, float combo, mini float combo. No, oh, he went for the mid parry. Oh, Got so caught. Smart. Yeah. Able just waiting it out just in case that mid parry might come out. And it did. And he punished it with the low. Yeah. Good stuff. Really smart stuff there from Able. And it sounds like he just went straight into rematch. Yeah, the, the, the options from these two players and even just like realizing how they get up off the ground has been so deep right now. Yeah. Round one, fight. What? <laughs> what? Why not, man? Oh, nice try. Oh, nice. there's the confirm. Beautiful re-splat combo. Oh, set that up for the size set one plus four. Nice whip punish there. And that's a beautiful start to this game number two for Abel. And he's looking solid here. 
setting the pace. Walking the call, seeing it in time. Counter a down jab though, everybody's gonna get hit. Man, just getting stuffed out here. Tagged by a little fireball here and there. Trying to find a way in. Whoa, he wow. just let it rip. That didn't even seem like a counter. He definitely wasn't, it definitely wasn't. He didn't expect him to even finish that. Yeah, just got caught. What I mean, a read from Aiden. I don't even know. That was definitely a gut feeling. And you know, this could be one of those situations where Roy Nietzsche could be looking at it as like, I should have chose the stage. Yeah. I would have went with the smaller stage. Yeah. It's definitely been his best his best uh, option here. Minimal float on the cost shot. The three plus four. Been missing the follow up, but it's all good. Still guaranteed either way. Yeah, Mornichi now has two meters, but don't, nice. won't even get a chance to use it. That was a beautiful game for Abel. The momentum is so heavily on Abel's side. You know, the first game of that reset, he just came out swinging and yeah. things started working. And, you know, he really threw off Roy Nietzsche off his game. That run up, down 3-3 at the start of the round. Like, mm -hmm. he's just in his head at this point. And those are big games for Abel Maestro because even if he loses this next game, you know where we're going. We're finishing the set in an infinite stage should he, should Roy Nietzsche win this next game. That's right. There's no choice. The stage favor is in Abel's side. Looking good here. Roy Nietzsche though, don't count him out just yet. Yeah, he did go to stage select. I'm not sure if he chose the stage or went random. But it sounds like he went to the Mishima building. Nice, a little bit smaller wall stage, a good choice. Fight. Fighting him, little poke one two handstand transition, just testing new things out. Both hits connect, man, tagging him now, just trying to move. Oh no, unfortunate combo. Yeah, now Bell is just being so aggressive right now. Nice red, the forward three after the down four, beautiful stuff. Yeah. The this is a different Abel. This yeah, is not he's the. Playing, he's, he's fed it up. He's playing it much faster now. Yeah, he's like, you know. Whoa! Dude! <laughs> All right, you want to talk about wave dashes? Yeah. Screw that. Yeah. Check out this Capoeira dash. Yeah, look at this. Wall carry combo. Nice, but Eddie sucks. <laughs> the wall carry. <laughs> oh, God. The heavy splat. No. Tries to re splat with it, but didn't quite get it. Oh, man. Dude, this is destruction. This is tournament set point for Abel Del Maestro. Nice. Confirming the back three two. This should be the wall. This is where, this, this is where Roranichi has to get started right here. This is where all of his damage has come from. Wow, spring kicking out this time though. Finally using a little bit of an aggressive approach to get out there. Oh, a little bit too close to the wall. Nice block there. Three, three, no counter. No, not this time. Not in range. Oh, he could have mid parried yeah, that. I'm always looking to mid parry. Just oh, relaxing nice the nice track. pokes. Brain Brain track track he's not, yeah, he's not going out without a fight. Oh. Counter. It's gonna be so much damage. Could be close to the wall. Yes. Good wall combo. <laughs> yeah, that's all he gets. <laughs> he really can't adjust the combo. Oh, nice float there from Roy Nietzsche, and he's gonna get the wall, side wall, but why not? Well, almost got the back roll catch with the claw there. Barely able to block that in time. Oh, oh no, duck! He delayed the string too. He just read him on timing. Able all over, looking to close it out. It's Final chance, oh. and that's gonna be it. Three zero. Abel Del Maestro takes it. Collision 2019 champion and the king of Peru. <laughs> Man, everyone's so happy. Shout out to Roy Nietzsche for getting second, though. Valiant effort. I mean, dude, really strong performance and really good, you know, uh, adjustment to his play. But, dude, that final reset uh, set, he just came out swinging. Yeah, the and Abel just closed it out. That, Abel, yeah, he looked so strong in that last set. Just looked like, you know what? All right, I know how to play yeah, this Yeah, I'm now. not playing games no more. Yeah. It's over. <laughs> Let me run it. And, you know, this is... Like I said, this is big for Abel De Maestro because he was outside of the top 20. I think this win here puts him 
pretty solidly in the top in the top 20. I'm not sure exactly where it's going to put him, right. but that's 300 points added to his total. And he was just outside. He wasn't like 45th or 87th. Big, he was like 300 points for Aval Del Maestro. Yeah. Shout outs to him. Man, it's, oh boy. Man. <laughs> Everyone's <laughs> trying to get a picture with the man. All of a sudden, he's a winner and he's getting all the, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm, now I wish I would have won. It looks, it looks, it looks so Seems nice like over there. like it's nice to be a champion <laughs> <Yeah>. over here. <laughs> right? Yeah, don't, don't you wish you were.